Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to transform a short Doodly video into a transparent video overlay. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. Have you ever been working on a non Doodly video and thought it would be kind of cool to have, you know, just a small little Doodly effect come in here and there? For example, like having Doodly draw in a little sticky note and have that appear on top of your video. Of course, you can certainly export this video and edit that into your existing video, but we want it to appear on top. We want it to be transparent, in other words. Well, you certainly can do that. It is an advanced technique, I will tell you, and you will need to use an external editor that's capable of doing it. But today I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. And I'm going to share a free tool that you can use. So you don't need to feel like you have to go out and buy an expensive video editor. So first let's make our doodly video and prepare it for transparency. This is my video. I said I wanted to put a little post-it note on top of my existing video that I'm making. So I have a little post-it note and a title. So this could be my little title sequence basically. Now, what I want to do is green screen this. So go down here to settings and click on the gear icon for custom and then custom color. And we're gonna choose a green background. Chroma key generally uses like a bright green, really ugly neon green. You'll see this like the weather report. Remember the famous weatherman stands in front of a green screen video. And what they do in the control room is they remove that green and replace it with you know satellite photos or whatever it is. So it's important that the weatherman or weather woman is not wearing this color bright green. Otherwise that would be replaced with the weather images. So go ahead and hit apply. Okay, so now we have this lovely green screen video. Okay, let's just take a quick look. And that's gonna be fine. We're gonna get rid of this green, remember? And then it's gonna be superimposed on top of my video, whatever that video may be. So let's go ahead and export it. And that's just gonna take a moment. Okay, so that's done. Now we need to go into our external video editor. I personally prefer to use Final Cut Pro, but it's, you know, 300 and some odd dollars. So today we're going to use a free online tool called Veed.io. And I've already selected my video. We're going to pretend this is my video, okay? And I want Doodly to come in with this post-it note and write my story title. So how do I get that in here? So go ahead and select media. And then you want to upload a file. If you recall, I saved mine to the desktop. Here it is. Take it a moment to upload. It's right here, right where I had my little playhead. Okay, so now I have my green screen video. And now we want to get rid of the green, right? So I like to go ahead and get to a point where I have all of the colors on the screen, just in case, okay? And then we want to go ahead and select it. So you just click, click right on it. And here are all of our tools right here. Don't choose remove background. Instead, choose green screen. This is gonna be much more precise than the remove background. Go ahead and click here. So click your little eyedropper tool and then click inside the video. And that removed the background, but it's a little messy. So here on sensitivity, I'm just going to adjust it. Let's go ahead and hit play. It's pretty good. You can go a little bit more. Oops, you don't want to go too far. See how that takes everything away? And that's pretty good. So let's go ahead and take a quick look. And there you have it. Your doodly video should now be perfectly placed on top of the existing video. Feel free to experiment with the different settings and techniques to get the perfect look. I hope this tutorial was helpful in learning how to use Chroma Key to place a doodly video as a transparent overlay. Thanks for watching!